Hello, dear internet. It is I, Kenny Dez, here to finally fucking explain why League of Legends is a shit, actual dog shit game that is completely unfun. In this video, we will be going over the main topics of why I personally find this game completely unfun and how I think playing this game competitively and trying to get good at this game is one of the biggest mistakes that you can mentally make that can damage your future relationships and your family and everyone you love while also causing you to gain anger issues. This is a warning for anybody that is getting into League of Legends. Please be careful. Watch this video so I can explain. The gameplay is terrible. Absolutely fucking terrible. For a MOBA, this game is dog shit. Some of their spells feel out of date completely. On top of that, mechanics are completely janky as shit. Fucking, it's so awful. It's just awful. This this isn't me being biased. I played this game for a fucking year. It is janky as shit. Character movement feels awful. Getting kills can sometimes feel satisfying depending on the champion. However, overall, the gameplay is just completely dog shit. Why? Camera movement. Player movement. Every movement in this game is awful. Absolutely From the abilities that can sometimes feel really janky and wanky from ADCs being able to get completely one shot by most champions to fucking mages completely getting run over by Silas and Katarina. Holy shit. But why do they get run over? Oh, well that's because of your terrible fucking teammates. Number two, terrible teammates. I've never encountered people that are this retarded in league. No, in general and how mentally delusional they are. They are not only terrible at the game, but completely toxic overall. I'm talking about mentally draining. I literally was playing fucking norms yesterday with my buddy, and I was so fucking tilted because Malzahar just had to fucking open his damn mouth, and because my dumb ass didn't mute, mute all chat, I got fucking completely tilted. And then I kept getting camped by fucking Nunu, which led them to fucking mass report me because I was. But then if we go over to the enemy team, oh, they're mastery. They get a fucking challenger on their team. Oh, would you look at that? Nunu spam ganking the fuck out of me when I'm playing TF. Might as well play safe. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. I'm getting tower dive under tower again. Welp, looks like I can't go to my fucking lane. Might as well roam. I have my R. Oh, wait. My Morgana isn't fucking coming up because, oh, the wave slightly pushed up. And my fucking Ezreal doesn't know how to shoot. Okay, yep. Free kill. Gone like that. I have a point and click CC. Nope. 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 I guess it's unkillable. Leading me to fucking die. God damn it. I fucking... Hate my shitty teammates and every little bit of my body. Why am I toxic? I am not this toxic of a person in real life. I am kind and sweet, I think, in real life. But this game makes me a bitter fucking toxic monster to the point where it fucked over with my relationship with one of my friends where I accidentally fucking said some shit that I wasn't supposed to and fucking team chat because this game gets me so pissed that i can't think rationally speaking of fucking rationally <laughs> this game doesn't want you to play why is because when you're getting tilted out of your mind you're not allowed to be fucking toxic out whatsoever even though the teammates are calling you shit saying that they fucked your mom which honestly is kind of funny however they're also leaking your fucking information okay and pulling up your fucking match history points and saying that you're a fucking abandoned fetus or whatever. You know, I want to just say, kill yourself. Why? Is because this game makes me want them to fucking obliterate. I'm fucking... I'm not even speaking real words at this point. This game is dog shit. League, if you don't want people to be fucking toxic, remove all chat. Remove chat in general. Just keep fucking peace. I don't fucking know. Or add voice comps so that you can express that you're fucking pissed off. Sure, there's going to be fucking kids saying like, oh, cringe, 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 whatever. Let that be, okay? I will have more meaningful experiences with my fucking teammates and I will not look at them as brainless fucking idiots. But nope.
banned. Why? Because Leak does not want you to play the fucking game. Leak does not want you to play. Everybody around you can get away with the most shit. They can say hard R racist shit all the time. But you tell your fucking teammate to fucking kill themselves. Oh, your team's saying X9 is TF. X9 is TF. Everybody fucking reports you. And then, bam. All because you said kill yourself. Even though they've been toxic shitheads the whole entire fucking time. Fuck! But let's ask the question. Why? Why are they like... Why, why, why is... Why, why, why is everything going so wrong? Oh, yeah. It's because you were up against a Katarina and you were up against a fucking Yone. You were up against a Silas. All these fucking degens that literally did one kill, they snowball in a matter of a fucking second. I don't care how fucking difficult a Kali is or how difficult fucking Katarina is. They shouldn't snowball beyond fucking belief. You nerfed Aurelian Soul to the ground because it took players like 500 games and fucking Dopal was saying that they're boosted trash but no let's keep the high mechanics champions even though that goes against everything that we previously stand for when we nerfed aurelia to aurelia's soul to the ground nope we can't have majors be op we have to keep assassins why it's because that's a great idea the next champion shall have an alt that fucking executes the whole entire team snowballing Mechanics ruin these fucking games. It makes it unplayable, unwinnable. It means your morale, it, it leaves your morale in the shit. Okay? Okay? Especially fucking ranked games. Holy shit in ranked games. God fucking damn it. Holy shit. Let's speak on the topic of mentally ill and just making you feel worthless. I have never felt worse in my life to the point where I sat in my chair actually depressed than going up against a fucking Yone, okay? It's annoying that I will be in the fucking top lane or the fucking bot lane or jungle or whatever playing my favorite champion just for this shithead to have a R that fucking knocks me up in the air then proceeds to do his whole entire combo. Bam. Dead. Just like that. Don't even get me started on fucking Katarina. I'm about to vomit with how mad I'm getting. Katarina. Holy shit. Katarina. She goes in and she uses her whole entire R. Oh my god. Just make the fucking characters more difficult. If they're meant for high level fucking challenger players. Holy shit. Oh my god, dude. It's like... I like this game, or I like this game, but the fact is, with releases such as Viego, Gwen, Action, all these overloaded champions, okay, don't even get me started when Samira first came out, oh my god, they keep releasing over two champions to the point where it's just not fun to play, because I will be playing fucking Dr. Mundo, okay, yeah, he got fucking read work, he's broken, I know. Gwen comes in, fucking cues 1v9s because of the fucking cat that doesn't play the damn game. God damn. Like, there's nothing worse than me trying to play a fucking nice game of TF, help my teammates out, just for them to all be dog shit, and ruin everything. And then fucking Gwen gets fed. I can't use my fucking projectiles because you know it'd be all. Yeah, you know who else has dementia? This fucking game! Oh my god. Holy sh. The final thing I'm gonna say. The final thing I'm gonna say is adding bullshit champions with snowball mechanics, as I previously stated. Akali, Kalarina, I don't care how skilled you are or whatever. There's nothing that feels worse than you getting one kill and being able to snowball beyond belief because you got a fucking blasting one or whatever. There's, I, there's nothing worse. There's nothing worse in this world than having a non, uh, like an unkillable person with five fucking alts or Canarina who spins in and kills everybody, Yone, Silas, all these bullshit assassins. It's not fun. Don't even get me started the fucking top lane with the fucking bruisers. What happened to the fucking good old days when everything was just so simple? God, I remember playing this game and it was just nice. It was fun.
Then he just had to ruin fucking everything by making every new character just nerf in a second. Nerf. They're not allowed to do quirky, funny themes. We can't have weird builds. The only thing that we can have is snowball fucking mechanics. Oh, oh, oh. Yone g gets a fucking double kill. Boom! Wee! Arr! Uh, I'm making this video off of like no hours of sleep for the past two days. This game has driven me to the point where this game is just not fun. I got a two week fucking ban and I really couldn't just be happier. It's a waste of money to spend money on this game, League, because of just how easy it is to get banned for how toxic your team usually is and how they will go and punish people literally entering in your games but you won't be punished it's just sucks how just dog shit and awful this game is there came a point in time where i wanted to improve but for how unfair it is and how unstoppable it is for snowball mechanics i get it it's supposed to be addicting you do good in one game you do good in every game. Like, I get it. Fucking. It, it's that mindset. But it also creates bad habits of you always wanting to be the fucking superstar. So you make stupid fucking plays. Because nobody is on track with you. Nobody is on the same way the length as you. Because you're not on voice comms. You're not on voice comms. Add voice comms to this fucking game. And this game would just be better. Because then you could be to, like, the fucking Viego saying, like, hey, man. Viego is like, v Viego got a double kill on me. I'm sorry. I'm going to need help, though. Hey, team, look out. Be careful. It's just simpler, easier, and funner. The fact of the matter is, though, it's companies like Riot Games and Blizzard and Activision that just ruin these types of games with just how awful they are and how terrible they are to their employees and just how terrible they are as people. I hope that Riot Games burns in hell for suffer for just ruining people's lives and ruining their mental state. I just hate this shitty game, but I don't want to. And I pray to God that somebody comes out with a MOBA that is fun, addicting, and doesn't have retarded snowball mechanics that makes the game unbalanced as shit.